You can't feel it. You can't see it. You may not have even heard of it. But a silent killer is in our midst. It is the leading risk of premature death in the world, well above smoking and infectious diseases. This killer is not lurking in a remote African jungle or in a shadowed downtown alley. It is here, in our backyards and living rooms. One quarter of Canadians are living with this condition, more than five million people, and many don't even know they have it. This killer often gives no warning of its approach, attacking first and asking questions later when it's too late. High blood pressure is the single greatest health risk facing people today, and there may be no warning signs. Hypertension's first symptom may be a stroke, heart attack, or death. Hypertension is the medical term for high blood pressure. But what is high blood pressure and why is it so harmful? Simply put, blood pressure is the force or pressure in our blood vessels that allows the flow of blood, which delivers essential nutrients and oxygen from our heart and our lungs to the rest of our body. Over time, these blood vessels can actually thicken and stiffen and this is often associated with an unhealthy lifestyle. So smoking, decreased physical activity, a diet high in fat and salt can cause thickening of the lining of the blood vessels. And in fact, this is cholesterol and fatty plaques accumulating. This all adds up to hypertension. Over time, high blood pressure causes excess strain both on the heart and the blood vessels. This can cause damage to the blood vessels with rupture, clot formation, and blockages, which then leads to stroke, heart attack, dementia, and even sudden death. The strain on the heart and blood vessels happens deep inside the body and may not reveal itself through any outward signs or symptoms until it's too late. The only clue may be your blood pressure measurement. Your blood pressure numbers tell doctors what's happening in your vessels and how hard your heart is working to move blood through your body. The higher the numbers, the harder the heart has to work and the greater your health risks. Knowing your numbers is the first step to taking control of your health and it's very easy to do. It's really important that you know your blood pressure numbers. For example, a normal blood pressure is around 120 on 80. And in most people, the lower the better. Even in the normal range, blood pressure can increase over time. And the higher the numbers, the higher the risk for stroke and heart disease. The number of 140 on 90 or greater is considered high and needs some kind of intervention. Treatment usually begins with changes to a healthier lifestyle, followed in some cases by medications. If you have diabetes, your numbers need to be even lower. The number you need to remember is less than 130 on 80. Getting your blood pressure measured regularly and knowing your numbers is the first step to taking control of your health. But there are many other simple things you can do to prevent and manage high blood pressure. For more detailed information about high blood pressure, talk to your doctor or visit www.hypertension.ca.